Hello everyone, so I'm going to do some, oh my phone's wobbling, oh is it going to stay? Okay, I'm going to do some very quick car chats with you. Um, I still can't find my attachment to put my phone on my windscreen, so I'm just balancing you again. Um, so it's half term, it's actually Wednesday when I'm currently filming this, but I realised I hadn't spoken to you like face to face I don't think, uh, since last week. So I thought I would just give you some background because I have got some footage to pop in. Um, so Monday I went to visit Daisy, my friend. I'm sure you all know her. Her channel is My Green Cow. Um, I went to visit her and her family because she is down south visiting her family at the moment. So she lives about an hour and a half further south than I do. So I drove down to visit her. We had a really lovely barbecue um, by her family's lake like they've got a lake on their land and um, we had a really nice barbecue down there and an afternoon there so I did get some footage and I'll pop that in now So that was really lovely and then yesterday was Tuesday and myself, my mum and one of my mum's really close friends from work, Rachel, who I know because I used to work there as well, we all made the trek up to Stoke-on-Trent to go to the Emma Bridgewater factory. We only get to go once in a blue moon. I've been collecting for two and a half years now and I've only been to the factory three times and one time it was just a fleeting visit because I was on my way home from Manchester so I popped in. but. Um, yeah, we made the trek up there and again I did get some footage, we had a really nice day um, looking at all the pottery, buying the pottery, um, we had lunch and we had a little cake break afterwards after we'd done all our shopping and yeah, it was really nice so yes, I will pop that footage in now. So that brings us to today which is Wednesday and I need to wrap this up quickly because I am running late. I have just been to the gym, um, didn't have as great a workout as I would have liked this morning because I'm having a bit of a bad Crohn's day, I'm not feeling very well. Um, but I made it to the gym, I got in an hour of um, a workout and I've had a shower, 
got dressed and ready and I now need to nip home, drop off my bags and grab my other bag because I'm going off to uni today to have a meeting with my tutor about my dissertation which I'm going to start doing over summer. So yes, busy busy, go go go, really tired but these things have to be done don't they? So I will catch up with you in a bit. Hello, it is Friday lunchtime. It's 10 to 12. This morning's been super busy. We went to the gym first thing, then Will went off to work. I came home, cooked myself some breakfast, had a really lovely bubble bath, um, and dried my hair off a little bit. I was gonna straighten it, but I decided not to because I was running out of time. Um, and I'm off to the Woodlands today at Hothorpe Hall in Leicester. So it's a long old drive away. Um, but I'm going there for the scrapbook retreat. You might remember I went on it last year with um, the lady behind Like Forever set it up. Unfortunately, Like Forever doesn't exist anymore, but one of the other ladies um, decided to set it up. I know my steering wheel's annoying, but I have to have my phone down low for long journeys, otherwise it'll just annoy me. Um, yeah, one of the other ladies decided to organize it herself at the same place so it's a bit of a trek but we had a really lovely time last year it's a beautiful venue so i'm hoping that it'll all be okay this year as well um i have seen in the group that there is some traffic so i'm just praying that i can avoid that as much as possible i need to stop to get petrol and then i need to go so i'm gonna leave you and show you everything when we get there before the next clip comes on i just wanted to say that this is just going to be a snippet of the retreat the full retreat vlog will be up in a couple of days so i hope you enjoy guys Hello everyone, so I've arrived at the Woodlands. I've just said hello to everyone who's here um, and I've quickly come over to dump the majority of my stuff in my room. So I thought I would show you my room. You might remember last year when I stayed here, I was in my own little snug with like a view over the fields. Sadly, I don't have that this time. I'm in a, it's kind of like a shared one. So I have my own room and my own bathroom, but there is, I'll just show you. There's a communal area here, if you can see that, with like a patio y terracey bit. Um, but yeah, I thought I would show you what the room looks like. So you come in and there's this little mirror on the side. This is my outfit today. This is a Kath Kidston skirt with puffins on it. Um, so you've got the window there. That is actually the scrap room across there. Got another window there. The bed, it's a nice big double bed. That's the bathroom, and then you've got like a wardrobe area, and I've just dumped all my stuff here. And then the bathroom, there is a shower, the light's on, so that's, I've got the shower, toilet, sink, and a bit of space around here. So yeah, I'm gonna nip to the loo, and then head back over to the scrap room.
Hello, it is Sunday morning. I'm looking a little bit worse for wear. I actually haven't been very well this weekend at all. I've had a really upset stomach, but um, it's fine. I'm really sad that it is the last day. We've only got until two o'clock. Um, so I'm just packing up all my stuff and then I'll head off for breakfast. So I've packed up all my overnight stuff in my bag there, my snacks, <laughs> my pillow presents. I'm going to leave them here while I have breakfast and then I'll come back um, and move it all to the car so that I can check out. So yeah, off I go to the scrap room. And just like that, the retreat is over for another year. I'm super sleepy, not really feeling this two hour drive home, but my car's all loaded up. We've had another lovely day of scrapping and eating. I dread to think how much weight I've gained this weekend. I'm not even gonna weigh myself this week. I'm gonna wait until next week after I've had another week at the gym. But yeah, so I'm ready to go home. Can't believe it's over again for another year. It's crazy. And I'm definitely taking more home than I arrived with. I was kind of hoping it would be the other way around, but that's fine.